back at it again with the tenacious t how y'all doing so my favorite thing to drink is what we're going to be tasting this week i got some tequila okay i love tequila if you don't understand why i love tequila please make sure to check out my other youtube videos maybe my first one the casamigos video watch that video and i will tell you very briefly on why i love tequila but i love tequila okay and this my friend is camarina tequila okay so this is their platinum añejo tequila it just came out it is 40 percent alcohol by volume it is made in Mexico. It's made with 100% blue agave. So it is the real deal when it comes to tequila, okay? If you're drinking anything other than 100% agave from anywhere other than Mexico, you're dumb, okay? You're stupid. You shouldn't be doing that, okay? You're trying to kill your liver, all right? If you're gonna drink, drink right. The platinum tequila is going to be like your Cristalinos. Cristalinos are probably my favorite style of tequila just because they have this little bit of sweetness to it. So it's kind of, I don't know, it just it has this nice little honey flavor to it that I really enjoy. It's aged as an Añejo and then it's not in a barrel so it doesn't get that oaky smoky taste that you would usually get from an Añejo, um, but it's still gonna have that clear color like a Blanco but it's an Añejo, it's been aged. So, if, as you can see, the bottle is open. Now, I had to try it. I went on TikTok and I did a live video of me trying it for the first time. And I'm not gonna tell y'all how that went, okay? Cause we are gonna try it again. Cause I don't know if I tried it right. Maybe I was already, I don't really remember. Um, we are gonna try it again, all right? So, one thing I did like is like the bottle top is wooden but the inside kind of looks like a pepsi uh top like it, it literally looks like they took a pepsi top from a two liter and they stuck that mug in there and then they made a wood around it so that is what it looks like on the inside i like this twisty um i'm going to be trying it out of a shot glass today because um i don't know i just want to try it out of a shot glass you can see it a little bit better in a shot glass it's a clear shot glass all right so this is your tequila. It's not chilled. I, I'm neither here nor there when it comes to chilled tequila. I mean, I think I like it chilled, but I also just like tequila. So I mean, if, as long as it's tequila, I don't give a fuck. I'm going to drink it, okay? But it is clear. It is an añejo. It smells very vegetal, very grassy, very earthy very minerally um i definitely don't think that when i tried it before i smelled it before i tasted it so i'm trying to get that whole experience and give that to you guys before i try it again it does have that little bit of sweetness on it like a cooked agave almost like a pineapple nice little honey notes on it like a mead it smells heavy that makes sense it doesn't smell like a light body tequila it smells very heavy all right so let's take a sip yeah not a fan as is the first time i tried it i don't like it i feel like it has that little bit of sweetness that I said that you're gonna get from a Cristalino or Platinum Añejo at the front and then at the end, it turns into like licking a lawnmower. It's like no flavor at all. It's like grass and ass. <laughs> it just, it's just not doing it for me. It's sweet, grass, nothing. Sweet, grass, rubbing alcohol. That is the evolution of this tequila. I like the sip tequila. If I'm gonna get an Añejo, this was $14.99, okay? This ain't no no young bull, okay? This ain't no no youngin'. This was a little, this was a, a little pricey, okay? So for them to disappoint me like this, I'm, I'm kinda I'm kinda sorry about that. I should have known because when I tried their Blanco, I wasn't really impressed, but I'm like, okay, some brands 
don't do good on their Blanco. It's like they just kind of put it out and they like, fuck it, anybody will drink a Blanco. And they really focus on their Añejos, their Cristalinos, their Extra Añejos. Their, they focus on those. So I try to give people a chance, especially in tequila. I try to give people a chance. And I shouldn't have. I fucked up, y'all. But it's all right. I'm going to take it as a shot. And I'm going to see how it goes and see if it changes at all. Okay, here we go. No me gusta. No me gusta. Yeah, no. It's not good. It it is it is smooth, meaning like it didn't burn going down. Because it is an añejo, it has a little bit more of those smooth properties. But the flavor is just not on par for what I need to be for a crystallino. It's just not there. So I would not buy this again. I would not recommend this to anybody. It is just, ugh. It, it seems like it needs a little bit of time. A better piece, a better pick of agave. Maybe this was like the, the beginning of the season agave and it was just super vegetal. I don't know. But they did not do what they needed to do on this one. And no me gusta. Now I gotta go drink some good shit. Um, I'm probably going to end up mixing this with the sake that I did in the last YouTube video. If you haven't seen it, make sure you check that one out. I'm gonna mix this with the sake, with some sparkling water, and we're gonna get the job done, okay? All right, we're gonna, we're gonna drink, drink, we're gonna make some cocktails, okay? Maybe I should do a video on cocktails. Y'all know how to do cocktails? If you like cocktails and you don't know how to make decent cocktails, Drop it in the comments, okay, baby? We here. I'm here for y'all. I'm here to teach y'all how to drink as a black woman that knows what I'm talking about, that has a degree in this. Holla at your girl, okay? Tell me what y'all want and I will do it. Y'all see I go out and I buy stuff. I put my money where my mouth is. So go ahead, hit me up, all right? But I appreciate y'all joining me in my Tenacious 10 today. This is the Camarina Tequila that we did not care for so much. Um, make sure you check me out on Instagram at Chef Tenay. You follow me on Tenacious 4. You will get all the newest updates when it comes to me trying things, me pushing out things, me telling you things I didn't like. Hit me up, all right? I love y'all. I appreciate y'all. Thanks for tuning in. Keep drinking.